Hello and a very warm welcome to Pendle College. I'm Nigel Watson, the Principal of Pendle, and I'm also Professor of Geography and Environmental Management. So if you're going to be doing a major subject or perhaps picking a minor subject in the Environment Centre at Lancaster, we'll see quite a lot of each other over the next few years. We're all really delighted that you've joined our community, even if for now it's only in a virtual sense. We're really looking forward to meeting you in person and getting to know you over the coming weeks and months. Clearly, the last few months have been incredibly challenging for everyone due to the global pandemic. However, you've shown your resolve and your resilience throughout that really difficult time, and you are now in a really enviable position of being part of Lancaster University, one of the very best and one of the top 10 universities in the UK. So even if you are feeling a little bit anxious right at this moment, which of course is entirely natural, I hope you're also feeling excited about what lies ahead and also very proud of what you've achieved so far. So as your principal, I'd like to address two fundamental and really important questions. The first question is, what is it like to be at the university? Well, part of the answer is that university is great fun. You'll meet lots of new people from all around the world and you'll form new friendships. Some of those friendships will last a lifetime. In addition, learning to un at university is very different to the kind of learning that you experience at school or in the sixth form or at a A-level college, for example. To begin with, there won't be many obvious differences. The teaching will, at Lancaster will be quite similar and you'll be shown how to answer questions and solve problems according to given sets of instructions. However, your learning at university will evolve on from that. You will learn to appreciate that there can be many different, equally plausible answers to the same question and not just a single correct answer, because after all, things are far more complicated than we initially appreciate. By the time you get to your third or fourth year at Lancaster, your learning will have evolved even further. You'll be able to come up with your own really interesting and creative questions and not just be able to answer questions that have been given to you by somebody else. This transition from a kind of instruction based learning to independent learning and critical thinking is actually very subtle and gradual. It's not something that you'll even notice. But as you become more independent and sophisticated um, as a learner, there'll be a noticeable difference and you'll start to be more confident and be able to question and challenge assumptions and things that other people might take for granted and believe to be undisputable. My second question is, what is it like to be a member of Pendle College? Well, all of the colleges are strong, vibrant, living and learning communities that offer everyone a home from home, no matter who they are, where they're from, or their cultural background. In Pendle, we have a number of priorities that guide us and influence the kind of things we do and the way that we operate. One of our main priorities is mutual respect and understanding for each other, regardless of where we're from or who we are. A second important principle is that we have a really strong support network for each other so that we can overcome our personal challenges and perhaps some disappointments along the way and develop as individuals. An equally strong sense of ambition is also important to us, setting really high goals, learning from our mistakes as much as our successes and celebrating the achievements of our students academic achievements, sporting achievements, careers, contributing to the well-being and welfare of other people around us, for example. Sustainability is another of our really important priorities. Thinking and behaving ethically and responsibly to reduce our impacts on the climate and the planet and to further the um, prospects and the quality of life of everybody, no matter who they are all around the world. 
But more than anything, our priority in Pendle is you. We will support you and help you to achieve the things that matter to you the most. And we'll guide you towards becoming the person and the young Lancaster University graduate that you want to be. So I'd like to end by using the same words that my own college principal used on my first day at university, admittedly um, quite a long time ago, back in the 1980s, in fact. He said, come on in, the water is fine. Indeed, at Lancaster University, the water is truly fine. So I hope you'll dive in, immerse yourself in everything in and around university life and really enjoy every minute of your experience. So good luck and I hope to see you in person and get to chat with you all in the coming days and week. Meanwhile, enjoy your welcome week and the arrivals process and stay safe. Thank you for that introduction, Nigel. Hi everyone, I am Lewis and I'll be our president for next year. I'd like to take this opportunity to welcome you to Pendle College, your home for the next couple of years. Pendle is a vibrant college with a great community spirit and I'm sure you'll all come to love it. You are now part of our student community, known as the Junior Common Room. Myself and these lovely people who I'll introduce shortly are the GSI Executive, or GCR for short. We are a group of students elected yearly by you to run and organise the various going-ons in Pendle. Each block will have an assigned GSTR member. You will have already met or be meeting shortly. You will also have an assigned fresher rep who will be an older member of the college who will be able to ask for advice throughout the year about the university experience. So here's a quick introduction of our GSTR officers. Firstly, we have our two lovely vice presidents, Jacob and Lydia. Jacob is a fourth year biological science student and is vice president of events and engagement. He organises and coordinates our events calendar and liaises with various societies across campus. The VP of Events and Engagement is responsible for organising Extrav, an end of year festival held by each college, with up to a thousand people coming to each one. Lydia is our Vice President Welfare and Education. She's a third year mechanical engineering student. She's also in charge of the welfare team and is responsible for coordinating the various campaigns we run throughout the year as well as the various de-stress events we run through term time. Next up is our two events officers, Mark, a second year mechanical engineering student, and Tom, a third year math student. Your events team are responsible for organising our fantastic events throughout the year. In the past, they've organised the quiz, trips to the cities, and of course, Pendle Live, our music event. Next is Laura, our media and communications officer, and a second year history student responsible for how we communicate with all of you. If you've seen any of the aesthetic designs on our Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, or posters, the chances are that she's the mastermind behind it. Megan is our sports officer and a second year psychology student. Your sports officers work with the captains and members of various sports teams to help organize events, promote, and support the sports teams to help them excel in our intercollegiate leagues. They also organise our annual sporting competition against Grisdale College, Warriors. Fraser is our audio-visual technician, responsible for looking after our sound and lighting systems. The AV tech is responsible for the actual running of our various live music events. In addition, they also support any virtual or online events that we do. And now for the welfare team, Yifei and Simon are our welfare officers. They organise campaigns, look out for your well-being and run drop-in sessions. Our officers are always available if you need a chat. Simon is a second year economics and politics student and Yifei is a third year accounting and finance student. And finally, there's myself, the president. I basically oversee and coordinate the GCR team. I'm the lead contact for Freshers Week and I'm the main point of contact between Pendle students and the university, college and students union. I can remember myself how daunting Freshers Week can be. It really does feel like you've been just been flung into a new city with new people and a newfound sense of independence. But whether you chose Pendle as your first choice, second choice, or even your eighth choice of college, it will become a true home from home throughout your years at university, as it has for me. We are a warm, welcoming and slightly quirky community, 
one which I hope you'll soon feel right at home at. My advice for you all is to really seize the new opportunities offered during this period and make the most of what life at Lancaster will offer you, both academically and socially. I think this advice has never been more applicable than in the current climate that we find ourselves in. Enjoy yourself, look after yourself and know that Pendle really is the place to be. Be sure to check out our Facebook and website to see what events we're going to offer across the next two weeks and throughout the term. I'd now like to pass on to Becky, the College Dean. Thank you for listening. Hi everyone, my name's Becky and I'm the Dean for Pendle College at Lancaster University. First of all, I just want to say a huge welcome to you all and congratulations on securing your place with us after what has been a really challenging year. We're really proud to be welcoming you to a college that is friendly and supportive and all of the college officers work really hard to make sure that your time at Pendle is the best that it can be. So my role in this is that I'm tasked with ensuring that all of the non-academic discipline regulations are adhered to, and this does include the terms and conditions of your accommodation if you are living on campus. You can expect that the deanery team will respond swiftly um, and thoroughly to any concerns or complaints that we that we receive, but we do ask that you help us by familiarising yourselves with the various rules and regulations and also by letting us know as soon as possible if you have any concerns or questions, anything that you're unsure of. You can contact us at pendledeanery at lancaster.ac.uk. For now, I'll just say welcome again, and I look forward to talking more to you during Welcome Week. Next is Luke and Chantel. Luke is the College Service Manager, and Chantel is the College Assistant. Hello, welcome and congratulations on joining us here at Pendle College. My name's Luke, I'm the College Service Manager, and I work alongside Chantel and we look after the day-to-day -day running of the college and we also look after your accommodation here in Pendle. Okay, our office is situated next door to the Porter's Lodge in the college foyer. We really look forward to meeting you all, so please come in and say hello if you've got any questions or concerns. I'd like to draw your attention to the university website, in particular the accommodation area because um, it has information on the residence handbook which is a useful resource that gives you lots of information about your accommodation and the expectations of you whilst you're living there. I hope you make I hope you make the most of your time whilst you're here in Pendle and get engaged with some of the many activities the JCR have for you. I hope you make the most of your time here in Pendle and get involved with all the events and activities run by the JCR and I look forward to meeting you soon. Thank you. Hi everyone and welcome to Pendle, the best college here at Lancaster. As Luke mentioned, I'm Chantelle, the college assistant. Day to day you will find me working alongside Luke in the college office. Things are a little different this year and for the first few weeks of term at least I will be working from home. This means that if you do send any queries to the Pendle College inbox, it is likely that it will be me that answers them remotely. You'll also find that we, have re that we are available on Microsoft Teams. You can use Teams to contact us via message or phone, but please be aware that there may be times we cannot answer due to meetings or other commitments. It is a useful tool to use if you have a quick question. I hope throughout your time here at Lancaster you, that you embrace everything that the college and the university has to offer, from the incredible Welcome Week events that the JCR have put together for you, to joining societies and taking part in college events. Here in Pendle, we are well known for our incredible pumpkin carving skills, pancake making, and even our sustainability ideas. We've even won the Sustainability Challenge two years in a row now. I told you before we are the best college at Lancaster. With that being said, welcome again to Pendle. We can't wait to get to know you over the coming year. Lastly, we have Ben Gale. Hi, I'm Ben, the Senior Advisor in Pendle College. That means I oversee the College Advisor team. The CAT is made up of members of university staff and we're here to provide pastoral and welfare support to all Pendle students. You can contact us at any point for support or for someone to talk to about any aspect of life at Lancaster. Things like homesickness, well-being, money worries, personal problems or any other issue you might have. So if you've got a problem or you just need someone to talk to, please get in touch with us. You can expect us to take your problem seriously. 
uh, to deal with personal information sensitively and in confidence and to help you find any other help or support that you might need. Get in touch with us at any time by emailing pendlecat at lancaster.ac.uk Make sure you check out our website again to see all the events we're putting out across the next two weeks. We've got things like live music, we've got quiz night, we've got more academically focused things like meet your course mates. We've also got intros to different sports teams in Pendle. Thank you.